Hey guys, so now when we are closing into the new 2014 smartphones, they are really really coming in very very soon. Mobile World Congress next month, next week, I mean February 24th, uh, it's like very 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 soon. Uh, now we, LG have unveiled here the LG G2 Mini, which is just the mini variant of the LG G2. The LG G2 was 5.2 inches big, this one is 4.7 inch. Uh, it, they're kind of doing the same as like an S4 mini phone, uh, or as Sony did here with the Sony Xperia Z1 Compact, which was just a compact version of the Sony Xperia Z1. And this is kind of like the same deal, uh, but it's not 4.3 inches that many other phones have been here, uh, like HTC One Mini, the Galaxy S4 Mini, uh, Z1 Compact, they all were 4.3 inches. This one is 4.7 inches, so it's a little bit bigger. I don't really know the price at the moment, but it, 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 this is the picture that you can see of it. It looks pretty cool, look at like a little mini variant here, uh, and just a compact variant of it. And it's a 1.2 GHz quad core uh, processor, 4.7 inch display, 16 GB uh, internal storage, 8 megapixel camera, 2440 milliamp battery, so pretty okay battery here, and a 4.4 KitKat. They will come in three different variants as well. Uh, and you can see here uh, they have four different colors as well. Uh, it, it has a global LTE variant and then a Latin American variant and then a dual SIM 3G variant as well uh, of this phone that, that will be out. And you can see here kind of like the color seems to be some kind of gold color, red color, black color and, and a white color that those seems to be the colors. And I'm probably going to compare this uh, device against the uh, against uh, these other, uh, maybe the C1 Compact and those in, in, in specific separate videos, uh, maybe, uh, just, to, just to see uh, if there's any big differences at all. I mean, the cool thing with the C1 Compact is that it's waterproof and dustproof, and those are some big things. Uh, I never actually picked up or checked out the LG G2, but I think the LG might have stepped up their game uh, a little bit since like two years ago or something. So um, I might check this phone out. Uh, but then again, uh, we do have a lot of high-end phones that's gonna come right now. So I mean, like the uh, the next next S uh, S phone, the Galaxy S5, uh, the uh, Sony Xperia. Z2, uh, maybe it will be called Sony Xperia Zerius, and then we do have the HTC M8, which is the next HTC One phone, uh, which we've been seeing even more leaks about uh, coming out today, and I'm probably going to do videos about that as well. Uh, but it, lo it looks good. Uh, I think it looks good. I think that LG here has uh, found a little bit of a cool, unique design, especially there on the back. Uh, that I definitely want to try out those volume up and down keys and see how that feels, if it feels okay, if it feels weird, I don't really know, I haven't tried it out, but hey, uh, it's exciting and it's pretty cool. Uh, so um, they are starting to come out right now and uh, definitely stay tuned for next week with the more World Congress on um, in Barcelona on Monday. It's going to be epic and we're going to see a lot of cool stuff coming out, So, or on VL at least. Yeah, peace out.